Blob is pregnant, guys. Oh my god. Maybe you're less of a blob and more of a Vivian. Oh no! Oh, oh. my god! Fido! <laughs> Fido! Fido, no! I squished! Fido, it was alright. Come on, come on, come on! Let's catch them all with Catch Em All Fishing with Zach Ketchum. Guys, you're gonna wanna like and subscribe. Turn on that bell notification button, guys. We had a little bit of a mishap inside Walmart, but we were saved, guys. What's happening right here? <laughs> Timmy, you just dropped that. <laughs> yes, you did. Grab, grab it. Grab him. Please. Come. Save him. No. Ah! Someone quickly. No, he's everywhere. He is a good Samaritan. Ah! Thank you so much. You're gonna be okay. Just keep on breathing. All right, just put him on the table over there. We can do this together. We still have time. Quick, Fido, 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 no, Fido, Fido. He's doing good. We can do this. Wait, we're good for real. That didn't work. It was a terrible. Your ideas are terrible. Save him. Is that bag waterproof though? Fido, Fido. Good job. Good job. Good job. Is it okay? Is it waterproof? You can do this. Wait, was that distilled water? Oh my gosh. Slip and fall sign. Don't fall. We're good, we're good, we're good. Fido, Fido. Hold him just like that. We'll be good. We'll be good. Hold him. Fido, Timmy, you can do this. Good job, guys. I'm proud of you. Thank you, Beyonce, high five. I almost slipped, but today, because of Beyonce, because of this good Samaritan, and because of Fido. You okay, Fido? You're gonna make it home, just hold on, buddy. Can we buy that water right what? there? What? Oh my God, there's hope, there's hope. We found water, we found water for Fido, okay, quick. We're gonna buy this water for Fido. If we can open it, we have to open it. Get him in there, Fido, forget this. Get Fido in there. Get Fido in there now. Hurry, boy. Wait, in there? Yes. Yeah, you're gonna have to put him in there. Exactly. Let her do it. She can help. She she knows her stuff. What's the water's all? Come on. Come on. You want me to pick up yes. The slowly, slowly, very slowly. Get him up. Slowly, head first, head first, head first. Fido! Fido, he's good. He's happy now. Fido. That is awesome. The day, you're amazing. Thank you, thank you guys, I appreciate that. You totally won't be forgotten. So guys, Timmy dropped our goldfish. We had some more goldfish. Where are you going, you just trying to run, huh? We all know it was you, witnesses. We all saw it, you saw it, right? Yeah, that's right. Timmy dropped our goldfish. We were bringing him home for the blob. Obviously the blob wants friends, you guys know that. We were saved today by the good Samaritan known as, what's your name, sir? What's your, huh? Drew, this is the legend, guys. He jumped into action. He sprung in there. That's my boy, Timmy. Let the goldfish die. <laughs> Save Fido. Drink some more water. He has too much water in there. Look at him. He's drowning. Remember you talking about how bad goldfish smell? Yeah, goldfish smell terrible. Smell, <laughs> smell the lid, man. Smell the lid? All right, let's smell the lid. <laughs> you touched the goldfish. Smell your hand. Yeah, that's right, boy. Mm-hmm. Fido, you okay? I know this poor boy, I should have never trusted him in the hands so of such a wild beast. Some aeration. That's a good idea for Fido. Since uh, the bag broke, do we get this 50% off? Yes, no? <laughs> Maybe today. What? Yep, scan him. See you, Fido. Fido! <laughs> I'm in tears right now at this thing inside this. Fido is doing pretty good. I almost don't want to send him over to the home of the blob. Can you see him, guys? He looks good, right? Fido is a strong fish. He's gonna make for some supreme, pure, and delicious blob food, guys. I would take a drink from this, but Fido actually smells like a stinky dog. As you can see, we have a ton of building supplies in the back of this truck, guys. We have so much crazy stuff that's gonna happen right now. What we're gonna do is take this to the blob, so we can go ahead and get our fish tank started. We'll be good to go. Oh no! Oh my god! Fido, no! We got squished! Fido, it was alright! Come on, come on, come on! Come on! Fido! Fido, no! He's alive! He's alive! He's alive! Fido, this is the strongest goldfish in the world! Fido, stay strong, buddy! Stay strong! Fido, that's a warrior! My hero! Bam, 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 bam!
really was gonna originally feed this guy to the blob. You know, the blob eats these goldfish and loves them, and they're really feeder fish. But I, I feel like he's such a trooper after what he's been through over there at Walmart. It was a crazy dropping him and stuff. Timmy, we just got rid of all of our goldfish over there. We gave him to Joey Slam, and now he has this huge goldfish army. But Fido right here, Fido has like really pushed through a lot, and. I kind of feel like keeping him. We're probably just going to have to get another goldfish and feed him to the blob, but Fido, it's time for you to swim free. Hello, you want food? Let me get some food for him really quick. We have some new food I'm going to try out today, guys, but I want you to check out our eggs. It looks like someone messed with this one. Hopefully it wasn't like my dog or something, because that one has definitely moved. That was over to the left, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. They definitely weren't on top of each other, so stay close, babies. I don't know, I have no idea. I've never seen anything like that, but I don't know, that would smell rotten. We popped that one, it didn't stink at all, so I think they're all good. Anyway, let's go feed our fish. What the heck? I leaned, Timmy, did you fart? They all ran from you. Try it, you'll like it, I swear. Yes, mmm. You must eat. And I stood here for a while to watch him eat, and look, at, look who came out. Those little catfish that I caught a thousand of, remember a long time ago? Oh my God, it's hard to see them. But there they are, there they are. Oh my god, there's five of them. Look at them. Here they all are, guys. The baby catfish are all up and down here. They like to hide way back down there underneath this fish tank for cover because they get really, really, really hot because they're really black. As you can see, look at this one. Hello, he's eating. Soon they're probably going to come to the surface to eat because I've been seeing them out a lot, like every time I feed them. And this is midday. Catfish normally don't come out until it's a little bit darker in the afternoon. Catfish babies everywhere. Yes. Come here, Fido. Come on. Come on, buddy. I knew. You're a hard worker. It is time to be free, Fido. You deserve it. I was going to feed you to the blah, but it is time for your new home. Goodbye, Fido. Goodbye. Shut up! No Fido for you. You'll be a good boy. All right, guys. Well, we do have to get a little bit of food for our beautiful puffer fish, guys. And I'm going to have some right here. One little scoop to do it. Ah. I only need one or two, and this is what we need. Look at these beauties. Oh yeah, fresh from the pond, guys. Going straight into the depths of our pufferfish mouth, esophagus, whatever. Yeah, just pufferfish food. And we also have to get snails. Oh, I should get a little bit of water. I almost forgot our snails. Come down with me, very close, my friends. We have our little fish right here in our bucket for our puffer, but you're going to have to bend down. Come on, come on. We have to pick only the fattest of the snails. Oh yes. Guys, we're gonna get one or two. Actually, how many snails should we get? Look at all the snails over here, guys. Oh, I'm falling. <laughs> oh my God, look at all the snails over here. Look at that snail topia, guys. So, we have snails to pick and choose from, as you can see. Snail topia. I think I'm just gonna get like, just a couple handfuls. Here we go. That's plenty of snails. Snails for days. Now we're gonna go ahead, go ahead and put them right over here. Snails, mm-hmm. Snails and fish guys, we're ready to go feed our puffer. Get nice fresh morsels for our beautiful puffer fish. We just gotta go stop at the store, stop at a Beverly's pet shop, and get one more goldfish for our beautiful blobfish to eat. We might be able to get one that just died today. Huh? You found turtles? She found turtles in the pool? What? She found turtles. I gotta feed the puffer fish right now. No? Call mom. She found turtles in <laughs> guys. Little turtles always around this time of year and around springtime. They hatch and they run into the pool. But I mean, we have stuff to do right now. I might have to go do that really quick between episodes. Maybe make an episode between this episode. But after that, we're gonna go feed the puffer all these dead fish. So we got everything we need right there, buddy. We just gotta turn on our tanks and see if these guys are gonna eat. What's up, baby? What's up? I love how this guy is always ready to just fight every single time he comes to my hand. Hi buddy, I love you. <laughs> it's weird because this other white crawfish, before I left, used to be so friendly and hands-on. But let's see, are you gonna come now? I don't know. Yeah, I guess I guess he is starting to move around again. But honestly, the white crawfish, as soon as I turned the light on, he used to run to the front. But I'm just starting to retrain him, so whatever. I'm not gonna grab the fish yet. I'm gonna try to start with the snails. So, this is what we're gonna do. This little tiny snail right here. As you can see, my hands are pretty dirty, but... I'm just grabbing this little tiny s oh, and see if I can taunt him up. Oh yeah, okay. So let's see if he wants it. 
Go over here to the right. Get, make sure you can see that, guys. Here you go. Here you go. Try it. Try it. You want it? You want that thing? Oh, oh, I dropped it. I dropped it. No, wrong snail. Okay, round two. Round two, guys. He's he's hungry. He's hungry. Let's see. Let's see. He's going to come up. Let me see if I can move this a little bit really quick because that thing is in the way. There we go. Here you go, buddy. You want it? You want that thing? Try it. You want it? Everyone says you want snails. Come on. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. No. No. Ah, that guy doesn't want it, guys. He needs the live fish. The snails are okay. I'm going to leave a couple of them in there, maybe to do their own thing. But honestly, I don't like introducing new things into the environment that the fish don't eat. So I have all these snails. I'm probably just going to have to put them right back into the pond. Ready. Into the puffer domain. Dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Go ahead, buddy. Enjoy. Enjoy. And that's what puffer fish actually like, guys. Those fresh fish, the puffer fish devour them. The bigger fish, the puffer fish would take little tiny chunks out of, guys. The puffer fish love the fresh fish. And who does not? Hey, buddy, I love you. <laughs> Look how fat he is. Let's go feed the blob. The blob. Now I'm feeding the blob his fish. Let's go in there. Go right to the blob. The blob will eat. I know you're hungry. Here, buddy, get close, get close, get close. Oh, yeah. Oh, ho, ho. look at that thing. Oh, 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 don't eat the skewer, buddy. You're good. <laughs> what a good boy. I love you. Yeah. That wasn't a very big snack, but that guy was definitely hungry. Blob is pregnant, guys. Oh, my God. Thank you very much, Beverly's Pets, for the dead goldfish. I appreciate you, my friends. <laughs> I think he wants another one. <laughs> I gotta go find some more. Turn on that bell notification, guys. You're gonna really wanna see the next couple videos. We're doing a lot of building fish traps and stuff, guys. Like and subscribe and catch them all.